how to get the Abyssinian cat in Adopt Me. Adopt Me's going and releasing a brand new cat in the new Desert Update. In the previous Desert Update, they went and released some special pets, including Scarab pets. And these pets cost you 200 Robux to go and get one. But the next time the Desert Update's coming back, we're getting the brand new cat. And his name is the Abyssinian cat. It's a fancy name. We even know the release date for this update, which is going to be on Tuesday. So on Tuesday, the 15th of February, 2022, we're going to be going and getting this brand new pet, which is only going to be available in the game for 36 hours. And then after that, it will be gone, and then it will come back the month after. This right here is what the pet looks like, the Abyssinian cat. As you can see, it's a cat, and it's got these lovely golden accents on it, giving it some very nice looking eyes, and some very nice looking ears, and it just looks amazing. This is what the cat actually looks like in real life. It's a breed of short-haired cats with a distinct tabby coat. However, this one's not the same color. I guess this is to do with the desert version of it. What I do know is this catalog's absolutely adorable, but we don't get to see the whole thing, which is a shame. I kind of want to see its full 3D model, not just its face front on. Which is where I came up with the idea that I'm actually going to go and recreate this cat to show you what its full actual model will look like. There are literally so many cats inside of Adopt Me, so I'm very surprised that we're going and getting a new one, but I'm definitely happy about it. By the way, I'm also giving away completely free tigers, so comment down below what you think I'm going to open right now, and if you guess it correctly, you can go and get it completely for free. I'll select a winner. Let's see, what did we get? We got a Luna Tiger. If you predicted that, liked and subscribed, you could go and get it for free. I'll select a winner. I think Adopt Me might be going and doing this update at the same time as they're going and releasing this new building update, which also seems to be very heavily themed around the desert, since it's all sandy. So I assume that this update will also be coming out on the Tuesday, meaning that this update is sooner than we expected. As for, is this going to be a Robux pet or is it going to be a Bucks pet? Unfortunately, there's no way to find out, but I imagine it's going to be Bucks. I'm kind of really hoping so because they already released the Scarab pet and the Scarab was a Robux pet, so I doubt they'd release two Robux pets, but at the end of the day, we've got no idea to tell. So wherever it is, I'll be going and buying a bunch and giving them away completely for free to my fans. We are now inside of Roblox Studio, the area that any Roblox game is created. And we're going to go and actually create the full pet to show you what it's actually going to look like. So I've just gone and grabbed an Adopt Me Cat base model. And we're going to start off by going and changing all of the colors to the exact colors. So since it's a black cat, we need to make sure that the cat is this color. And then it seems like that the inner part of it is golden. So we're going to go and select a golden for the inner part of the ear like so. And then it also has like a golden area around the rest of the eyes. Also, the rest of the body isn't like a full solid black, the same as the eyes. It's a slightly lighter version. So that way the eyes like pop out a bit more. You can see there's a t different like color variation in it. So these cat ears are actually very pointy. So what I need to do is go and transform these and make the ears pointy. What I've now gone and done is made like these golden eyeballs, which will just like slot in and look like the golden part. Okay, so here's the original, the actual pet, and uh, <laughs> here's what I created. Guys, can you spot the difference? Uh, I, I tried, okay? This, this, is, <laughs> this is what the 3D model might look like. I imagine the rest of the body is going to be slightly different, and I'm pretty sure its eyeballs aren't going to be popping out like I have created. Um, so it, I tried sometimes it doesn't go to plan. I mean you can kind of tell that it's meant to look like the pet and Yeah, it's close enough. We'll take it. We'll take it rate it down below in the comments 1 to 10 I think it kind of looks like it, but it's also kind of creepy So to go and get this pet You're gonna need to go and head over to the desert area to go and get to the location to go and get this cat for yourself You're gonna want to go and teleport to the gift display This is the fastest way to go and travel to the location where the desert entrance is going to be as the update currently isn't here We can't actually go check it out 
but there will be a section right here where this will just become sand as the water kind of evaporates and there'll be an entrance to a tomb in, made out of sand you'd walk down it and then you'd be able to go and purchase this brand new pet and I really do hope it's Bucks but there's no way to tell so whatever it is I will be going and giving it away completely for free so even if it costs Robux I'll let everyone who's watching this video have a chance of getting one by just commenting their username and make sure you like this video see if we can get 2,000 likes and that would be insane. So there's not much more to talk about for this brand new cat apart from the fact that obviously you can make it neon and also mega neon but I'm now going to go and check out my friend's new concept game as he's just gone and created something called an extinction event. This guy is literally one of the best people at making adopt me concepts and they always blow my mind away so I thought I'd share this to finish off today's video. Over here he's gone and created a series of brand new pets which are apparently extinct which is quite sad. We seem to have a type of frog or a toad which I think already literally looks like an adorable pet and I kind of want Adopt Me to add one. I mean they've already got a frog, um, this one, this just looks like a really cool frog. As for what these animals are, I'm not 100% sure, but what I do know is that these are some pretty cool looking birds and some pretty cool looking animals, especially this one. It does look like something that Adopt Me would go and add into their game. I mean, Adopt Me adds like 100 variants of a cat, so I wouldn't be surprised if they go and add a new variant of a frog or a toad or something along those lines. As for what this is, it kind of looks like a moldy turtle. I. <laughs> I don't know, is it a Glyphodon mixed with a turtle together? It looks like it. Oh, it says all of the names. We have a Blue Buck, a Great Orc, a Passenger Pigeon. I guess that's a pigeon that's extinct. A Giant Tortoise. Okay, so it's a Giant Tortoise. And uh, Oro an Orox. Yes, my favorite animal. Is that what this is? Bro, I have never seen this animal in my life. I think I'd be scared. It looks like a penguin mixed with a dodo and a bit scary. I'll be honest, it kind of looks like something out of a horror game. It does say I can speak to this character though. Um, but did all of this, all the, using the nuclear, um, interesting. So I guess some nuclear thing, uh, attacked the adopt me world and, uh, it did this and Bert, Bert started creating new pets. Well done, Bert. Well done, Bert. It then seems they've also gone and created like a bunch of other things such as like vehicles or toys which I guess you'd be able to go and get in this pretty cool concept. This guy's game is actually really detailed and also incorporates something for the household egg. In case any of you are wondering what the next Adopt Me egg is going to be, it's a high chance that it's going to be a household egg because Adopt Me said what should replace the fossil egg and they gave us four options. And obviously the ocean egg went and replaced the fossil egg and then the mythical egg went and replace the ocean egg and the one in third place is a household egg so there is a very high chance considering the other two have already gone and replaced the previous eggs and it's done it in the correct order a significantly high chance that the next egg is going to be called a household egg so if you do want to know like what types of pets could be in this then let me know if you want to see like a video down below um if you want to see like what could be in this household egg this is like a concept of what the egg would look like it's literally a house on an egg i mean it makes sense what else would a household egg look like and also i don't know what all of these buttons mean like a w star what, what is it is that oh i think it means wishes actually okay then this is a cool bucks button and then dress up family work bro imagine there was a work button i mean they're kind of getting there they added the task board update which is the closest thing to getting a job we could see happening for now because it's like give a person a gift or go do this kind of mini jobs but without being called a job it's pretty cool anyway thanks for watching i hope you enjoyed this little concept bit at the end i wanted to make sure we entertained everyone use star code candy bye